this is Taylor, and you're watching The Wolf's Den. Hoo-ya! Hi, this is Taylor. You're watching The Wolf's Den. We're at Wolf Den today. We're going to go behind the scenes at a photo shoot that Wolf and Maverick are doing. So let's go take a look and see what's going on. Going on. Whoa, it's a surprise, surprise! I didn't know you were going to be here. Alright, uh, we are doing the photo shoot. we got some crazy gear going on right now. Okay. Saw yesterday's show. This is the new multicam stuff, the whole gear. It's great setup we got going on. So, hi to Maverick over there. Hey guys. And you're wearing the white again? This is ATAX. ATAX, the new stuff. And, um, yeah, where is my... We're going to be shooting right now with airsoft rifles. And, uh, we're going to talk about this. Best. We're going to be talking about that pretty soon. That's okay. a new AK for Come in nice, nice and close. Way. Get sexy. Um, <laughs> this is crazy. We're going to be shooting with this today, and we're going to be shooting with a couple of uh, Tim and Marcus today. So okay. we're going to have fun. You going to hang out with us today? Of course. Hell yeah. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> I like that. For those of you who are wondering, this is the proper way to weave Molly. This is the important part, guys. Once you get this locked in, not a lot of people do this. If you leave it like this, it's going to slip. You double this right back. Don't just stick it. Curl it up. There we go. Nice. Thank you, sir. The swing is on, boys. And then you want to release it, you just go. Nice. Pull it back up. Beautiful. Sexy. <laughs> Custom painted just for this shoot. That is like, that's art. That's talent. That's genius. All right, what we got here, guys, this is the brand new Magpul PTS Masada. It was the hottest concept rifle ever made in real steel. This is the airsoft version of it. This is contracted by Magpul PTS, made by Ares. This thing has all the bells and whistles of the real thing. Start off simple and easy. Everyone knows, comes with a Magpul. This is a 120 round magazine, PMAG. Locks right in. Going through the features, we'll go back to front. This particular model here is the collapsible stock. Big thing with the UBR stock. You can just pull it out to get to the position you want. Adjust it just like the real thing. The uh, classic Magpul M-Bus sights lock up front and back super easy. To the push of a button either way. We've added a name point on this to uh, further make it tactical. Uh, 
Just like the real thing, this is completely modular, completely ambidextrous. Selector switches on both sides. Safe semi full auto. You rack it exactly like you would a real gun. Now the cool thing with this is it is ambidextrous as well. You can have it on the left or you can have it on the right depending on which side you are. Rack it back, you can check your hop up in here. And just like the real gun to release it, you have an ambidextrous switch at the front of your trigger. <laughs> Done right like that. Simple, clean, easy. Push pin design. There's two push pins in the back here. Pull those out, the receiver splits, you can get to your gearbox. Push pin in the front, pop it out. Your foregrip slides immediately off to install your battery. Silver wiring throughout. We've also added to this one Magpul's angled foregrip. Gives you that proper grip to it. They believe it's a better shooting technique. A lot of guys love it. Super popular. We've also added an, uh, an AMPEC 15 on there, uh, or at least a replica one. Explain to what that is. It's a military uh, unit. It's got a flashlight and a laser designator built into it in real. This is, of course, a mock-up. Takes a battery, you get a little bit of laser, a little bit of light on it. Uh, she's beautiful. Gen 2 gearbox inside. This you're is talking the, about the gun or are you talking about the host? Both. <laughs> oh, no, she is a Gen 2 gearbox. So the gun is a Gen 2 gearbox. Oh, we made her blood. <laughs> uh, just like the real steel, completely modular. You can make, this is the, the assault rifle version. You can make a CQB version, a DMR, designated marksman version of it. You can put the bottom from a 5.56 configuration to a 7.62. Takes the AK mags. You can put a fixed stock on the back. This is the collapse. This is the folding stock. It, it does everything. It's, this is the hottest airsoft gun out there. No question about it. So now we're back with the new Javelin AK Tactical. This is Javelin's new marker. Javelin's a company coming in hardcore into the U.S. with airsoft guns. Real steel version, tactical version of the AK. Collapsible stock on the back. Very, very cool. Simple, easy to adjust. Uh, polymer magazine with it. Updated uh, mag release right here. As opposed to the thumb pressure one. Locks your mag right back in. Classic AK safe, full auto, then semi-auto. Not like the way we do it, which is semi or safe semi-full. Tactical front built in with the foregrip, rails everywhere. Always a high impact polymer. It's got the uh, Loudner slash Frash hider on the front. And just like a lot of the new guns coming out, this baby's simple to easy, stick battery on the inside, silver wiring. She's ready to rock and roll over the box for you. Look for these everywhere. All right, thank you, Maverick. You're welcome. Are your shoes okay? Oh yeah, I've got my nice boots on. <laughs> sure, well, don't worry. Nice. Okay. Made for walking. All right, I didn't even see Maverick over there. Nice. Is, uh, yeah, you gotta get a shot of that. Blending in very well. We're gonna take a little break while they set up the next shot. Yeah. We'll see you guys in a little Thank bit. Thank you for watching this episode of The Wolf's Den. Um, first off, formers. Do not hate on the airsoft stuff. This stuff is crazy. This stuff is awesome. Uh, we're all a part of the same Milson scenario type of gaming. And I, this airsoft stuff is so cool. You just got to appreciate it for what it is. Um, I know some of you guys don't like it, but come on, get over it. That's kind of like when speedballers don't like woods ballers. That's some little baby boo-hoo, wah, wah, I didn't like it, yeah, it's not realistic. Shut up and enjoy the sport for what it is, baby. And I got to say, yes. Full clip might cost extra, but you gotta understand, this stuff is hand sewn from scratch. It's made in America, and it's got a lifetime guarantee. Yeah. Think about that, who else is doing that in this sport? This is the real deal. Um, it's not some massive corporation to doing it. It's a, it's a small outfit with a few guys running it who love the sport, love the real, realism. You gotta appreciate that for what it is. I left LA with nothing. 
just so that it wouldn't influence what I say about these guys. I got nothing but goodness. I can't even get a rating out of 10 because I would give it a perfect rating. Now it sounds insane. Full clip is where it's at if you want the realistic, durable gear. Hotness. Oh, and uh, the red-headed hotness tail is hot too. Thank you very much, Taylor. You're the bomb. Damn. Now, dun 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 for uh, all you guys who I've got the number one requested thing on the Wolf's Den. You asked for it. You harassed the company, and they said, "Here, Wolf, please test out the brand new Takamo conversion kit kit by Rap4. That is it. I have got the Rap." for conversion kit for the A5 to convert your marker into a magazine feed system. I will be doing a special, special, extra long episode on this uh, to fully test it out, to show you how it's put on. And I will be truly testing it out to, to see if it really works, if it's worth the money, and if it's good. Rap 4, I hope you guys come with it because a lot of people are asking about this. I mean a lot. Between Facebook, oh, I gotta thank uh, Philip Excellent. for asking these guys and A5OG.net website to hook and work up. Uh, you know, people at websites like that are dedicated to this sport. A5OG.net is a huge place to go to if you like them in A5s. Oh, yeah. Baby. Now, last but not least, this is a. Uh, I was having a debate with my friends not too long ago about how to make this sport bigger. Paintball is getting smaller. Uh, we're losing a lot of players, especially in the tournament area. This is one. Uh, thing that me and my friends came up with that would be a great solution. Get the dads to come out and play with you. All you young gunners who come out and play with this house, I see some fat ass dads waiting for you come in to drive and pick you up and say, come on, son, time to go. Why isn't your dad playing with you? Why? There's no reason for him not to be playing with you. If, okay, first of all, get your dad to come to the screen. Get him to pay attention for a second if he says he's too busy. Tell him that your friend, Wolf, uh, has two university degrees, uh, runs two corporations very successfully, I might add, has two children, a five-year-old and a seven-year-old that I bring up as a single father. I ripped up my golf membership, lost 50 pounds, started playing a sport big time. Look at me now! You should be playing a sport with your son. Seriously, like, I'm not just saying that. Like. What else? This is the new going in the backyard and playing catch with your son. It's paintball, the adrenaline filled, massive exercise happening, and it's the most fun you will have playing. You can't play any other sport like this with your kid. Dads, get out there, support this sport with your kids, and have fun. If you can't, what is more important than playing a sport with your kid? Think about that for a second. If you're, are you too busy to play? What's wrong with you? You're not busier than me. I can guarantee you, you're not busier than Wolf. And look at me. Come on. So dads, come out and play this sport. Support it and have a lot of fun. I guarantee you will have fun shooting side by side with your son or daughter. Yeah, you come out, bring your dads, bring your friends. Tell your dad to bring their friends, yada, yada, yada. And hey, bring your moms. And if they don't want to play, they can come and hang out with Wolf. If they're hot. Yeah. So ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this uh, episode of The Wolf Den. Thank you very much. Next episode, I'm going to be having a special HD episode of us running around the mountaintops in California with this new equipment. And the episode after that will be this uh, Rap 4 special. It's going to be an extra long episode. It's going to be intense. Key and stay tuned for the next commercial for Living Legends. That's right. Coming back. If you have not heard, Wolf has been made the general of one of the sides for Living Legends for NCX Sports. And uh, yeah, it's going to be the most insane game of the year. I guarantee that. Oh yeah, baby. See you next time. Woo! Oh, where did my summer